Right guys, I don't know what time it is, I've been to see the boys. Been to see them. It was only, God, a light lunch. This is weird being out on this scooter on my own. I haven't been, I haven't been out in a few weeks, have I? Me, like this. It's a beautiful day though, look at our sky. But it is, it's so goddamn bumpy. There's that many uneven ground potholes. I think it's gone too. I haven't even done any shopping. Do you know, honestly, I, I'm i not in any mood for it now. But I've got no bread. Nothing. No bread at all. Right, I'm going to go and I'll catch you later. Right. Oh, flip. I've been to Iceland, got my cheese. Yes, I'm in Iceland, but I said I'd come in for bread. Is that it? Is that the only bread Iceland do now? They can't do. Oh, I'll go and have a look at the other end. Oh, hang on, half and half. One forty a loaf. I wonder what it is in Aldi. Where's Aldi from it? Oh no, I've got to go back, haven't I? Oh, hang on. Mix and match. Any three for three. Oh, it is, yeah. So if I get a Danish. I got my cheese, guys. This is what I'm on about. Sainsbury's is the only one. So I got three packs while it was in. Six pounds. Well, that's the only cheese I'm allowed to eat. That's not bad, guys. Three loaves. Yes, if you, I'm putting them in my bag, but I'll pay for them when I get to the till. Ah, that's it. Bread, cake, any three for three. Oh, I can have some tea cakes, I think. Can I eat tea cakes? Yeah. Nothing in there. One crumpets. Oh god, that's a big one. Are they thin though? Oh yeah, thins. Three. That's me bread and me crumpets and me tea cakes. Cake. I can't have cake. Eggs is a rarity. It's no use looking in the freezers because no. Right, that's it. Bread and cake. A uh, cake. See? Just bread. I'll show you when I get home, but all bread. I can't eat another. Can I eat these? Very good. Oh, they're strips. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I love these on wraps. <coughs> Sixteen point four saturated fats. I do not think so. Forget no. Oh. Oh well. Got me. Oh god, this is all changed. Three for twenty-four. That was the same as that uh, farm boot. Oh god, where's all the veg gone? Right, I'm going to pay for this lot because there's no use looking at frozen. Oh, excuse me, guys. Sorry. I don't have to get my salad from here or go with me veg person, but I want to go. Oh, I'll go to the veg person, sod this. Right, I'm going to pay for this because I can't. Oh, I got it. I can't have anything in here. Right, we'll go pay. That's your business in Iceland. Can I have that fish? See, some things have said... See, 
a low. I've got that at home and I can eat it. So, you know, like the gastro. I'm not on the low fat no more, but it's high fat. No, 10.6. Right, I'll go pay for this and we'll go and have a look in uh, where is it going to go. I'll go look somewhere else. Oh, fruit page lady. Right, and home bargains. I got me, uh, I wanted a big one, but then we got it. This, Sanex Zero. Just been in to upgrade my phone because when I went in in June, they said it was due the end of June. I've had taxes. Your phone's due an upgrade. Just been in now, it's September. Middle of September. I thought, make up your flipping minds. I said, fine, I'll wait. I said, but can uh, any chance you can possibly stop texting me? It's all the time, guys. Mind you. Look at this, it's dead. Mind you, I don't know what time it is. I've got to get home. My neighbour's got a little dashy. He does when I go out. It's that like ages, I think, since I left with the boys. Oh, look at that, 4 99 Little balloons in it, and I think it... it they inflate, I'm not sure. They do something anyway. Look at this. I just spoke to a lady now. She's been at the park with a grandson. Two grandsons. See? Dead. Two grandsons. And she was there about three or four hours. And she said... There was no kids, nobody on there. I noticed one thing in here. They've made the aisles wider. This is what I got thrown out of. Because the aisles were narrow, you couldn't move round, and they were pretty funny. Really funny. I don't know what I'm looking for, guys. It's just I don't know why it's quiet. But I'm going home now to my little dashy poo. And we'll go for a walk. I know what I'm looking for, but I can't find it. Can I have that pasta? Totello. Let's have a look what's on this. Three grams in that, that won't be bad, will it? Spinach ricotta, chicken and bacon. I don't know. I'll go for the chicken and bacon. I'm sure that is. That's not bad. I don't know. It's not bad. Oh, I'll get one. Oh, squeal. What I'm after is... Cottage cheese stuff. Right, I'm going home to my little baby. Oh, no cottage cheese anyway. I want something for pud. Why is everything just cake or? Why is 
everything will be flipping cake. All I'm gonna have to do is make myself a trifle. I'm, I'm looking to see if that cheese is in here that I said about, that I eat. And the only place is Aston and Sainsbury's have seen it. The trouble with the kids being off, I try to avoid them. Someone's excited. Biscuits, new. It is so difficult because everything is freaking cake. What? Chocolate. See all this lot? Which it would be, for obvious reasons. So all I can eat is rice friggin' pudding. But at the same time, I'm losing weight like it's going out of fashion. I'm literally losing weight. That's another concern of them. What's in the penguin? I can't eat cake or anything like that. Three point eight in one penguin. <sighs> it's not bad it really, is it? But it is, it's really getting me down. It's just nice to have a cake now and again, but I can't even remember the last time I had any cake. Well, this has gone on for, what, five weeks, so, right, I've had nothing. Cake, biscuit, nothing. I used to like a biscuit with a cup of tea at night. Nah, not allowed them. What could I have for a pudding? I'm going to have to start making a trifle, but then I've got to watch the cream. Oh, cheers, I tell you. Well, I guess I'll never be back to what I eat. See, I start eating all this blooming food. Got lazy since my son left home because everything used to be cooked from scratch. And I end up, yeah, this has nothing to do with what you eat. It's nothing to do with it at all. Whatsoever. It's got nothing to do with what you eat. Right, this is bacon and stuff. That's honey. It's got. A, oh, I could have a lolly ice. I could have a lolly ice, couldn't I? Ooh. I could have a lolly ice. Or a bag of mini cheddars. That's that's my option for uh, pudding. I've got low-fat rice pudding. That's where I'm going for strawberries. I want a drink, but I can't find any individual. Oh, I'm gone. Lucas says. I don't know what time of day it is. I've got to get home. Lucas says. Don't they do individual drinks? In home bargain. Far from Lucas Aid. Oh god, that's suddenly turned busy. Right, I'm gonna go. Right guys. Five o'clock. I went out about eleven. Something like that. Ten, eleven o'clock and it's five o'clock, I've just got in. I had a good day with the boys and that. It's been good. Spent some time with them both. I went straight there. And then, uh, I don't know, it was about... I can't tell what time I left now. But, uh, yeah, I had some, spent some time with them both, so it was nice. So I'll show you 
I went and done my shopping after. Right. I went to Fruit and Veg Lady and got green and purple grapes. A bag of tomatoes, spring onion, cucumber, new potatoes, good sized bag, really nice there. I'm not sure about this because I need my rain glasses to see. Elm Lee Single. So, I don't know about this one. I asked a member of staff and the Elmley Light, which is odd, the light one, and Elmley, the other one, I asked her and she said they were high. She said, try the single because I think that is less. But if it's not, Never mind. I can have this cottage cheese. I know I can have that. It's cottage cheese. Oh, it hasn't got the chive, I don't think, on this one, but it's fine. Then from the fruit and veg lady. Peach. I haven't had these in ages. Another peach. And another peach. I can't eat cake, biscuits, you know, things like that. I've just got stick fruit or uh, yogurt. I used to have a biscuit with a cup of tea at night. I'd have two biscuits. I can't even have them now. Um, oh, from my shop on the way home. A pound, that's all that was, a pound granary, a granary loaf. Uh, what else I got? Nine Andrex toilet tissue. I went to Sainsbury's because the only cheese I can eat now I can't eat any other cheese because of the high, you know, fat content in it. Is eat lean grated cheese, ninety percent less fat. That's what I can eat. So I got one, two, three. It's only Sainsbury's and Asda. So. It's not bad cheese at all, but it hasn't got, you know, a lot of flavour to all the cheeses, but that's the only one I can eat now. Iceland, that's all I went in for, was the Crumpet Fins, two of them, and the only one I can eat... It's four fruity tea cakes. That'll be my cake from now on. And they were three for three pounds. Then I got Danish Warburton's bread. Another one. And then the half and half. There was three for three pounds. And that's the only thing I got from Iceland. Oh, 12 proper good large Yorkshire puddings. I'm allowed them because... Uh, for one Yorkshire pudding, it's only 0 0.3 grams. So, yeah, I got the large ones. I got a double lettuce from my fruit and veg lady. 
I got a bottle of comfort for me washing, make it smell nice. These I got from Home Bargains. I've got them in the fruit and veg place, but they're all right. Probably won't last as long. Some strawberries and some mushrooms from the fruit and veg lady. And that's it. My shopping is dropped drastically. And then I bought Sanex Zero. Two of them. And they were Home Bargains. It has, my shopping has dropped drastic to what it used to be. So, yeah, that's it. So that will do for the month with what I bought Friday. I want to go meet Man, but he was closed today. So... That's all I can really. I can eat lean meat, fruit, veg. I want to do all my meals. And in my case, I can't have like biscuits. I looked at the penguins, but they're too high. So um, I don't even know about that single cream unless I put a little tiny bit on my strawberries. But yeah, besides salad, fruit, veg, meat, I'm limited to what I can eat, even eggs. So, I'm not on the low fat diet, which was a nightmare, being on that, but nothing high fat. But I used to always cook meals from scratch when I had the family at home, always did. And then I got lazy, no excuse, when they all went. I'd say more so here. I started eating all these foods that are not good for you. But this has nothing to do with what I've ate, nothing whatsoever to do with what I've ate. It's rare what I've had. It's normally animals and kids that can get this. It's rare in adults. But it's got nothing to do whatsoever. I can't go lifting. I can't go lifting at the moment. I've got a, a couple, I thought there was one, but he said, no, there's three or four polyps on my gallbladder. But this was my actual bowel that had gone in on itself. Do you see what I mean? It had nothing to do with anything else, apart from what they found on my gallbladder when they were having a, a look round. So, yeah... I've just got to completely change things now. Be careful what I eat. Oh, I was just coming home and I could smell fish and chips. Oh my God. But no, that's a new, new, no takeaways. Unless I have a wrap with a salad in, but that's it. But no, it's got nothing to do with the food I used to eat. Nothing at all. It's only because of this I'm having to go on a low fat diet and change my diet now, you know, going forward. This is just something that's happened. You can't explain why it happens. I 
and I just happen to flick and end up with it. I ended up getting it. But because of what's gone on, he said, don't go lifting. Don't go lifting anything heavy. So, yeah. At the end of the day, the way I look at it, I'm here. Because I might not have been here. Because it can be fatal if it ruptures. I lost my bobble. In my hair, I lost my bobble. So, it's just one of them things in life isn't it things go well but all of a sudden click of a finger something you know can happen it's only for the pain that i was in and it was it was from one hip to the other all across my stomach all the way up here all around my back and my kidneys the pain was awful, horrible. I wouldn't wish it on anyone. I couldn't even keep water down. So he says, good job you come in because if it, you know, if you managed to pull up with it, it could have ruptured and you wouldn't be here today. Even though the operation was a uh, touch and go. But luckily it went back to normal, which it can do. It can come back. It might not come back. Hopefully it don't. So, yeah, it's just a matter of getting on with it now. Make sure you look at your life, I tell you, when something like that happens. It sure does. It certainly does. Right. I hope you've all had a good day. I know it's Tuesday, but I said bear with me with videos. I did say Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but just bear with me. I've enjoyed it. It was nice getting out. I want to spend as much time possible now with my grandson and my kids. Because this has certainly opened my eyes. Appreciate, you know, you, your loved ones when they're here. When you why you're here, because you never know what can happen, do you? I certainly didn't think how serious this was. And it does, it makes you think. Oh, could be nice that it's granary smells lovely i thought i'd get a fresh loaf it'd be nice with a bit of jam or toast uh jam or toast marmalade or something on it right need that I didn't even know I had polyps, to be honest. I don't know anything about them. 
It was only because of all the CT scans I've had. They found the polyps on my gallbladder. But I've just got a scan in a year's time on them. But this other issue, like I said, I've got to have an MRI, I've got to have other tests. Oh, my fridge won't shut so yeah i'm grateful that i'm here to be honest because it could have gone the other way it could have easily gone the other way so i am grateful for actually being here mind you i'd probably still be talked about if i wasn't here to be honest, I'd still be talked about if I wasn't. Right, I'm going to put them in the freezer. These are good. These are it zero. Right, I don't know what to keep for my breakfast. I'm going to have a tea cake tonight, I think. And for my tea, I'm having a, I think a salad. Shall I have some crumpets out for tomorrow? For breakfast will be a change, won't it? There we go. Right, let's put the rest in the freezer. Yeah, that cheese is good, guys. It's the only one I can eat. You're yeah, right, sweetie. I'm home now. Talking to Dash if you're wondering who I'm talking to. Right, tip the cakes and I'll put them there. I've got the two trays to clean. But yeah, it's been nice. I'll go and see the boys on uh, Friday. And I've told my daughter I want to spend as much time as I can with my grandson. Because you never know these things. You never know what happens in life, do you? That's a Let's get off that subject, it's too depressing. Oh. Yeah, I went along the road on the scooter. I went the road, then the path, because the path's uneven. I got some pain meds. I had to pick them up at the doctor's, so I've got them. I still have pain, but I've just got to take things easy and slow. Oh. Yeah, that'd be nice then. I have one with a Sunday road. Right, I'm going to sit here for a minute, have my coffee, cappuccino. I think I've got my letter for my MRI. I only saw the surgeon Friday and it's what? Tuesday. 
I thought, I know he was going to sort it out for me, but flipping heck. I think it is, I don't know. It's got NHS, so it could. Ugh. Anyway, I'm going to do myself. I'm tired now. There's one thing since I've had this. I'm on an air. Uh, I take my vitamin D every day, but he's put me on iron tablets. I've got them. Um... And I've just picked up some pain meds, oh God, from the surgery. I've got the sun blaring in my eyes. Where I am, I'm so tired. It's took it out of me. Absolutely shattered. Well, my garden's not going to get done this year either, is it? Luckily, I've got no housework to do. I'll put the scooter away and I've got some nice ham. Do a bit of salad. And then uh, get a shower. And I might put my PJs on and that'll be me for today. I've fed Dash and he's got water. So I thought I'd just have one of my coffees. My uh, flat white. All I've had today is just... Um, There's a coffee, no another. I normally have a coffee in the morning. Oh, um, no, I've had cups of tea all day today. Oh, I had coffee at the park, that was it, and a flat white now, and that. I'll go home to my tea then. It's been a good day, but I'm absolutely knackered. I've got to put the scooter on charge because I want to go and see the boys again Friday. The weather's nice, get out. I think it's been about 70 today, something like that. I can't sit here because I'm going to fall asleep and sleep. I am absolutely shattered. I'm so tired now. God, I've got to move that flipping scooter. I'm feeding myself. I thought a salad, there's, I'll have it about, what, half six, because I have eaten today. I can't even eat a lot right now. I've lost five pounds in weight since all this. Five, six pounds. Yeah, my stomach is like a balloon, but... Not surprising what I've just been through. Oh, right. So I'll end the video. I can't even eat a lot, that's the thing.
Oh dear. Small and often, that's what the best thing to do. Yeah, I've got this. Yorkshire Gold. My youngest, he said, have you had this tea? I said, no, I have Yorkshire. He said, take that, because I've got boxes. He's got loads. I said, he's stocked up. He said, yeah, Mum, I'm stocked up. So he said, you can have one. So I've got the some tea bags in this. He said, try it. I had one, two of his. And I sat in the garden. He's had his gardener. Oh, it looks nice out there. What is that? Ah, it's the thing they put round your wrist. I must have just threw it in the drawer when I come home. Must have just threw it in the drawer when I come home. It's me label. You know, they have round your wrist. Don't know why I put it in there, but it'll go in there for now. Anyway guys, I'm going to go because I'm absolutely shattered and sort my tea out. I'll get a video up for you today. I'll see how I get on with them. And then... Uh, but I hope you've all had a good day anyway. I'm trying to be my happy jolly self but it's difficult right now. But, I'm trying. So anyway, I'll speak to you all probably tomorrow. So take care, stay safe, have a nice evening, and I'll speak to you all tomorrow. I think there's a birthday today. I read them all out, didn't I? So yeah, I'll speak to you all tomorrow. Bye guys.